Yo, yo. What's up, folks? It's, uh, I'm Silvano. And I'm Chris. Where we're doing the Youth Outlook vlog. Medical marijuana, well, basically what happened was it's been decided that medical marijuana patients and growers can sue over the rates. Um, of course, majority said a marijuana patient or member of a collective has the same right as anyone else to sue officers who violate the constitutional ban on illegal searches and seizures. So, um, it's kind of like a step toward forward in the whole like legalizing marijuana realm. You know what I mean? But That's, you can still grow pot legally though. Well, you can't do it unless with you have a card. card. Yeah, with a card. Yeah, yeah you know. But but I mean, basically, that, what that, this is yeah. the, no, they're yeah. just recently the raids stopped. Okay. Mm -hmm. And before that, the raids were going on all over the place. Police were raiding clubs growers' houses, all over the place, even though these people had their cards, because under federal law, it's still illegal. Now, what, the, what they just decided was that those people who got raided have the right to sue. Mm -hmm. Despite the fact that it's illegal under federal law, they've been given the right under state law, and the state decided that they, could, they can sue the cops because it is an illegal search, you know? Yeah, it is. So, like I said, this is kind of a move step in you know the direction towards legalization of marijuana in california which is kind of a direction we've been inching towards slowly and slowly more and more and i kind of want i wanted to bring it up just because i uh marijuana I'm, is so popular well i, I mean I'm, be, I'm i'm supportive of it you know Definitely. i think we we have you know of course i understand why people frown on the legalization of marijuana but currently we have a huge budget deficit of like what is it 24.6 billion dollars yeah. that's a lot of money right and if only for the reason that we need money i think we should legalize weed because california is responsible for a third of the nation's pot it comes from california and we don't, don't tax that. that we don't we don't we don't get anything from that and we need all of this money and that just seems like a huge resource that we could take advantage of so i mean so you're trying to fight for them to legalize it i mean yeah and it's not i'm not trying to fight so much from the you know i want to be able to smoke weed because it's not a harmful substance stance i mean i can understand people being against weed i mean how, that's just how it is but we need to think logically like weed would make us a lot of money and mm -hmm. guess what we need a lot of money but so, it could cause a lot of chaos as well nah, come on dude alcohol causes a lot more chaos let's yeah, not yeah, let's not kid right ourselves that, it yeah. would it would lessen chaos weed is is a sedative you know it would get rid of the chaos the I worst thing alcohol it would do, is the worst drug the worst know? thing it would the, the worst thing it could do is maybe make people lazier and then the population would stop working which could be negative but i mean we don't that know how that's gonna really play bad, out though. that would be very negative but we don't know how that would play out we do know for a fact that if we was legalized, we could tax it, and we would make a lot of money. And so I just, I felt like I should, you know, bring that up. Because I think, I think it's a step in the right direction, and I think we should continue to push for that. Because we are in a financial crisis, and this seems like one of, uh, one of the better solutions for that. Uh, but that's it for today. Thank you guys. Check us out again. Peace.